Welcome to Technical Drawing. Today we'll see this sum in isometric. Front view and side view is there. Length is 95, height is 80 and width is 30. So we'll draw layout first. After that, now if you see in side view, there is only one part. So we'll start with side view. So this is 30. Then I'll go down by 40. Then go inside by 10. Then you draw a straight line. Then again here you take 10. Then gap of 15. Then straight line. So we are done with this part. Now we take this entire part behind by 95. Whatever is there on the left side, the same thing will be there on right. With that concept. See this. So we got this top part. Then we can extend this. Now we need to draw this two curve. Now if you see from here I will take 40 see first I will take 20 to find the center point this total length is 95 I'll take midpoint which is 47.5 this total length is 95 so I will take midpoint which is 47.5 and then I will take 15 so 7.5 7.5 on both the sides Now we need to draw a circle. So from here we'll take 40. And again from here we'll take 40. So I'll get a rhombus. Now I'll join longest diagonal. Now I will join longest diagonal. And then midpoint. From the opposite corner. We can follow four center method to draw a circle. So you join longest diagonal, find out midpoint and from the opposite side corner we can join these two midpoints. This is one, two, three and four. Same way here also we write 1, 2, 3 and 4. This is M. So from point 1 we can draw R. But we don't require that. We take it from 3, 3 to M and we'll draw R. So all of you understood how to draw this part. I can take this part behind by 10. I'll take this point 3 inside by 10. That is 3 dash. Now I'll take radius. From 3 dash I will draw arc. And I will join this. Now from point 1, we'll draw R. And this portion will be dark. Now we'll take this point 1 behind by 10. And we'll mark that point as 1 dash. Now we'll take this radius 1 to M. And from 1 dash, we'll draw arc. We'll extend this line down. From here, we'll join like this. So 
so this way we got this isometric i hope all of you understood this thank you